Hello everyone, my name is Dolphin Hastings. Welcome to the latest edition of my Grand Theft Auto videos. And they walked away. Now keep in mind, everyone knows the And They Walked Away series. It shows some of the most amazing crashes in motorsport. And what you're about to see is seeing all the drivers survive the odds and walking away. We're going to show you crashes from monster trucks, supercross, anything that we can have. It's in this video. Enjoy And They Walked Away. We start at the monster truck track at the college. Pat Roy trying to do his best impression of Northern Nightmare. He got the fire part. I gotta love when two monster trucks go side by side. Uh oh! Aren't they supposed to be killing him? Too wide of a turn goes Christopher Warnick. Safety officials take him out. So why does he have gasoline? We're here at the off-road course. On a rainy track. Uh-oh. Back up the ramp and uh oh. Anytime when a truck gets pitched off to the side, anything goes wrong. little things do that. Oh! Wait a minute, that's not extreme. This is... These things going up against Moby Graves and uh-oh. back on all fours, and this was in the final lap of the race. Colby would end up winning the race while Hastings would turn it over on his head and finish second. Not bad, guys. Hey, wait a minute. That's not nice. Back at the uh oh. Oh, oh. Nose up in the air, rolls it on over, and crashes right into him. I've seen it all now. Okay, now I really have seen it all. Ooh, right up. How did he do that? Hey, we 
talked about that finger. Fred's trying to cut across. Ends up doing a 360 in the air. Uh-oh. I don't even see how that was possible, but it was. Some doom buggy racing at the horse track. Uh-oh. Raccoon head spinning him out and eventually going into the water, both of them. Damage the camera. Whoa! Always strange as fuck. Come on, guys! We talked about this. This is a strange sighting. Down to some ATV racing at the insane supercross track at the horse track and oh! Kevin Willicke trying to get the pass on and ended up going right in the back of the bike. Now we switch it off to some gray enduro racing at the Vinewood Beach. It's amazing how little vehicles like these can still put on a good show. Why we pay those big camera guys big bucks for shots like this. Oh! Kevin Willicke, I don't know if he was having issues with the car, but he just went right into the wall. Now back at the horse track for some great pro arena truck racing and we got issues. Rolls it right over to the stand. The officials will be there any second. Racing in the rain at the Super Stadium Sports Truck event. They brought the bikes out for one. Oh, God. I think this is the last time event manager Colby Gray decided to bring the motocross bikes out as he smacks down hard into the puddle. Eventually getting up and walking away, or whatever he's doing.
Uh, we got the Legends of Drag Racing, Colby Graves and Dalton Hastings, and Colby Graves catching on fire. Supercharger explosion. Getting out under his own power. Well, not the same for the car. And then it was time for Hastings' turn. Trying to keep the car off the wall. Even though he knows he's already lost the race. Again, the next week, again his arch nemesis, Colby Graves, but again, the same thing happened. Catch a break, and oh! Into that wall, he would eventually get out under his own power. And the third car he ever had blows right up. As soon as he gets off the line, the blower pops off and the engine explodes, leading to a humongous fire. We now go mud racing. It's a bench like these, no matter what goes on throughout any bit of an incident, as soon as the car stops rolling over or catching fire, the safety team is already there at the scene. Oh. Again, with the bike being at the track, it feels like everyone just rolls or, or just falls down. That's the true definition of them. They walked away. Here's Pat Roy. Oh! I think he got knocked out. I'm gonna take a look at that again. Another view. Poor Pat. He ended up getting knocked out and having to go to the hospital. We're back to the FMX track with a nice backflip. Oh. Trying to get over the subway. Didn't even get close. Now one thing when you're watching a mud race. Oh! Oh, well, that could be one thing. Stay out of the way. Kevin Willicke going on to check. I don't know what that was, but we're back at the monster trucks now.
amazing how sturdy these trucks can be, no matter what track they take. I love the mud drags that go on the horse track. Even though they're running through water, you gotta get the fastest time. But, not supposed to be like that. Oh! Devin Willicky and his Mud Patrol remake. The officials going out to check. Officials drag him out of the car. He can be okay. Here we go with the Mud Patrol pitching off against Toby Grayson. Uh oh, wait a minute. Uh oh. We have some issues here. The officials aren't so sure whether to break it up or not. Oh, there we go. There's the signal. Are you kidding me? He was on fire. It's always the mud patrol. Now we go rock crawling. Something new that we've done. Oh god, we've got we've got trouble. We have got major trouble. Come, the bike coming down with Col oh no idea why Colby wanted to try to do a front flip but here they now come back again this is lap number three ooh ooh and a double crash Kevin and Dalton we now go into sprint cars Watch this again and you'll see what happens to Alex. Colby Gray's upside down. Would eventually get out under his own power. And as the title says, and he walked away. Here come the bikes again now as they come down through the far corner. Remember this is the insane supercross track, so anything can happen on this type of a court. Oh! Including that. Kevin Willicky trying to go up for the pass eventually connects with Hastings Yamaha and has tossed him right off the bike. Eventually gets up and walks away. Now... Okay, these guys are just trying to kill me now. Take a look at this again. These guys are crazy. They're trying to get Kevin out of the car. He would eventually get out under his own power. The Vinewood Casino, the Vinewood Horse Track. This place has been used for many motorsports activities, including the Super Stadium Trucks, the Mud Drags, the Monster Trucks, the Quad Wars. Everything that we have run, it's always been used at this facility. 
and we will continue to use this facility for many times we run events. Well, everyone, this will conclude, and they walked away number one from GTA Motorsports. I sincerely hope that you guys have enjoyed this. I want to say thank you to every person who has helped me out with this video. Pat Roy, Alex Parrish, Colby Graves, Christopher Warnick, Kevin Willicky, CJ Berez. You guys have helped me out amazingly with this video. And I also want to say thank you to everyone who has subscribed to my channel. I don't know if I'm at 1,000 yet, but I'm getting very close to it. I want to say thank you all to have subscribed. Thank you. Thank you. Now, get ready for the one-minute blooper reel to conclude, and they walked away one. So long, everybody.